So, I mean, right here I'm showing you how you can play the Witcher 3 version of Gwent, because as cool as I think, you know, the other Gwent is, I think this is the superior version, like this version here. Oh, oosh, what a banger. I actually like how you can just play this here. And it's got the OG music. You can't turn it off down there if it gets boring, by the way, but... I mean, this is how you play Gwent in your in your bloody browser modes. I've got a bookmark just here, so I mean, that's the URL there. You can edit your, um, oh, sorry, double audio coming through, but then you can bloody, hold on, let me turn that, but yeah, and then you can bloody edit your, edit your, your deck and whatnot, you can change your faction, and this is literally how you can play like the old classic, like the Witcher 3 version, so I mean, that's definitely pretty cool. Come on, baby, oh, this guy has more cards than me, oh, I should really pass. Well, either I commit and hope for a victory. Oh, I think I have to pass. Fuck. Okay, this is not good. Oh, he had clear skies. Oh, okay, I stand a winning chance here. We place her down. And we go for... If I get a spy, I get two cards. Or can I use this chick and then use her ability to now summon a spy to then give myself two more cards? I like that. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. And he has fought. All right, he's screwed. So if I do this, I think I kill his card and my card. No? Opponent's passed. Haha, <laughs> wimp. Wimp. Let's chuck him there. Bring back. Who do I want to bring back? Uh, didn't let me choose there for a little bit. Wait, can I bring back the decoy? And replace it for him. So then I win. Yeah, buddy! Anywho, I mean, that's how you do it. So The Witcher 3 version of Gwent in a, your bloody browser. I mean, honestly, I could waste so much time on this. Not to mention... What a jam. What an absolute jam.